opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The Sicilian defense controls the d4 square with c-pawn. Nf3 develops the knight toward the center to prepare for a d4 pawn push, where the knight will recapture if black captures on d4. Nc6 helps control both the d4 square and the e5 square. Bb5 attacks the knight on c6 and prepares to castle kingside. e6 controls the d5 and f5 squares, and allows the queen and dark squared bishop to develop. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. Nge7 develops the knight toward the center, defends the knight on c6 and controls the d5 square. This prepares the bishop for development. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade takes back. It is the last book move. This is a fair move. It is good. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is best. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This wins time by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is good. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. This prepares the bishop for development. It is best. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is best. This develops the bishop and gives it scope on the long diagonal. This threatens to win a pawn. It is good. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is good. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. This strikes at the center, countering the opponent's ability to grab space. This threatens to win material. It is good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best takes back. It is best. This wins a tempo by threatening a rook and forcing it to move away. It is good. This misses a better way to move a rook to safety. It is an inaccuracy. This moves the pawn to safety. It is excellent. This loses a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This is the way to win a pawn. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. That pawn was free for the taking. This threatens to win a bishop. It is best. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is best. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. There was only one good move there. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. This ignores a better way to defend a pawn that was under attack. It is a miss. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. This permits the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is a miss. This attacks a rook, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is best. This loses material. It is a mistake. Takes back. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This evades the check from the queen. It is best. This overlooks a better way to create a passed pawn. It is an inaccuracy. 
That was a truly amazing move. This is the only good move. It is brilliant. This forks multiple pieces. This threatens to play checkmate. It is best. Right on target. It is best. This misses an opportunity to capture a free pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This defends the attacked bishop. It is best. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. White really outplayed black in that one. Black had a good opening, but white was on another level. That was a well-fought middle game that white got the better of.